everybody, how you all doing? And welcome to our latest belly fat destroyer workout. Now, as you know by now, I only unleash one of these babies onto you when we've reached an amazing goal and milestone. And this time around, it's a pretty special one because we've just gone past 100 million views here on YouTube. In fact, YouTube even sent us this beautiful plaque to congratulations on this amazing achievement. And in my view, it's an achievement for all of us because you guys spread the word. And from my side, I just wanna say once again, thank you for your continuous support. Now, apart from giving you this amazing workout, I also wanted to give you guys something even more special because this is such an amazing achievement. And so I've decided to give all our fans the first week of the brand new six week six pack challenge 100% free. So if you wanna come and join us, there will be no cost involved. Please go to this private link, which is sixweeksixpack.com forward slash seven day fan only. Okay, please go to that link and you can sign up and you can come and join us for the next challenge starting in a few days, 100% free of charge for the complete first week. So with all the formalities out of the way, let's get back to today's belly fat destroyer workout. Okay, so this workout is gonna consist of three exercises and we are gonna do what I call a trifecta cardio core workout where we basically have three intervals rather than just one high intensity and low intensity interval. So the first exercise, which is basically a push up plank. Okay, so you just stand here and let's get this right before we go any further. So your hands is just wider than shoulder width. It's below your chest and then you crunch your core and you also contract your quads. That is automatically going to put you in a proper push up position, but also the position that we want for all these exercises because all these exercises is going to be done on the floor and in this specific position. Okay, so your push up. Okay, plank, that is gonna be your active recovery. And you're gonna do that for 20 seconds, okay? As soon as your core starts hurting, you just drop down to your knees until you recover, or if for that specific 20 seconds you wanna do this, that's fine as well, okay? Once that is done, you move on to the second exercise. So the second exercise is basically mountain climbers, but you bring your feet to the outside of your hands. So once again, we get in that position, we contract our quads, how oh, cool, that's gonna put you in the right position. And then you're simply gonna do this, okay? Look at the pace, you want a decent pace because we're now getting you ready for the next exercise, which is gonna be pretty hectic and pretty fast. It's pretty much gonna be your cardio version and your high intensity version of this workout. So, you've got your active recovery exercise, which is a normal push-up plank. Then you've got your mountain climbers where your feet goes to the outside of your hands. And then we get to the main baby of this workout. Okay, watch how I do this. We get ourselves back in that position. So first you're gonna do a jack, okay? Then from this position, you're gonna bring, you're gonna go into mountain climbers with the one knee, then the other knee, then back out to a jack, okay? So let's do this full pace so you can see how it goes. And then as soon as you're done with that for 20 seconds, you just find yourself back in this position again. Okay, make no mistake, your core is gonna hurt after the third or fourth round. So all three of those exercises is one set. You're gonna do a minimum of 10 sets. And if you are advanced, you can take that up to 20 sets. So what you do for me, you warm up for three minutes just doing jumping jacks, for example, and then you go on to the first exercise where you get your core ready, you activate it by doing that push up plank, 20 seconds. After that 20 seconds, you go straight into mountain climbers where you bring your feet to the outside of your hand. And then that for 20 seconds. And then straight after that, you go into the jack mountain climber combination for 20 seconds. And then after that, you go back to 20 seconds of push up plank for your active recovery. Like I've said, if that's too much, because your core will hurt eventually and you will be out of breath, you can just drop to your knees, take a sip of water, and continue when you're ready again. So there you go, guys, the latest belly fat destroyer workout. Let me know how you get on. Subscribe to my channel, click on the like button, and if you have a question, ask it below this video. And then don't forget, if you wanna come and join us for the next six week six pack challenge for the first week, 100% free, go to the link that you're gonna see on the screen right now, and I'm gonna see you over there, and we're gonna push as hard as we can and kickstart your fat loss like nothing else. Until next time, guys, enjoy this workout, and once again, Thank you for your continuous support and helping us achieve these amazing milestones. Bye-bye.